They usually take important prisoners to the bunker on the other side of the island. The other side? They have a radar observation center there that would have spotted us. You'll have better luck cutting through the research facilities. What kind of research? I can't talk about that now. Just keep an eye out for anything moving. And if you see anything that looks dangerous, well, it is. Hey everyone, welcome back to my Far Cry 1 walkthrough on the PC, played on the realistic difficulty. Um, this is mission 5 I believe, research. Starting off on an island. What I like to do is head up over this hill and we're going to mark some enemies off on the binoculars. Okay, next we're going to get out the old sniper's rifle, head sort of in between these trees, and what I like to do is just pick off about five enemies on the beach. Sick guy, I might just take him out. Yeah. Okay. Helicopter's gonna come for us as well, but if we stay in these trees, they won't see us. You wanna keep an eye on your left side, just for some enemies that will come in between the rocks here. There's a few more coming for us down here. I like to try and get headshots where I can just to save some ammo. Now if you're pretty quick, sometimes a helicopter will come, sometimes they won't, depending on who's been alerted. Uh, we seem to be making pretty decent progress here. There is quite a number of enemies. So you just want to take your time and try and pick off just a few where you can. Sometimes if you can sort of shoot them once, sort of like that, they'll start moving and ideally come over to your position. Just makes it a little bit easier. Um, just let them come up. Once again, like all of the maps in Far Cry 1, it is a game of patience, unfortunately. So it's a good idea to try and get as many as you can just to come over to you. And then what we'll do is we'll move up uh, in between these rocks here on the left hand side. Try and take some more enemies out. So I'm just going to wait. Just to see who else uh, comes along. Okay. Doesn't look like any more are coming, so fortunately we might have to sort of move forwards a little bit. Nope. 
I have a feeling one of these guys is stuck between the rocks. So, as I said, what I'm going to do is come around here and just sort of hug this left-hand side of the trail. And ideally, what I would like to do is try and take a few guys out. Oh. Someone almost saw me. So if no one comes out, what you can do is fire a single shot. Hopefully get some more enemies to come up. Like that. Using the trees as cover as always. The guy on the left can be a little bit annoying. That's got him. You can try and move a little bit further around. Just want to kind of work your way around this left hand side. It looks like someone's coming up to our position. Good idea to keep an eye on the mini map. can be a bit tricky to get the enemies to come out. Okay, this guy on my right is being annoying, so I'm just gonna just do that, take care of him. Sometimes it's worth just spending the armor, I mean the ammo on the sniper rifle if it helps clear some enemies out. It can be a little frustrating sometimes. Okay, I'm going to head up the hill. It's a good idea just to keep your binoculars out where you can. Make sure the um, island there is all cleared off. And there's two more enemies further up ahead, so we want to take care of them.
make our way up to this tree. We one to the left, one to the right, hopefully. I'm going to just keep tabs on this guy up here. Okay. That should be everyone. Um, what I like to do is actually just backtrack a little bit just for some ammo. It's not... In, wow. There is ammo further up, but... It's always good every now and then to keep the binoculars out. Just make sure you've got everyone. They tend to stay put most of the time, those last few guys, so yeah, if everyone else hasn't come up to your position, they um they'll be there, hopefully. It's a side note. It's a beautiful map on the outside. Go onto the island and grab some ammo. Yeah, real pretty. Some health if you need it on the wharf up here just to the left of those crates otherwise there's armor here and health and ammo basically a good little top up as well as some sniper ammo that's quite good yeah and there's a bunch of, of course guns and things left over from people we've taken out We're gonna make our way up the hill here grab a key card so we can carry on Try and sprint for a little bit. It's a shame that the sprint only lasts, you know, so long. The rest of the time you're just left walking. In here, keep in mind there is armor, health, ammo, uh, the key card we need. Uh, so don't be afraid to backtrack because the next section is a little bit difficult. Okay, so as you come into here, there should be one enemy left. He'll be guarding the gate. I hope it was the only one. Okay, that guy was killed. He doesn't have any drops, which is annoying. So no ammo. Where are you? I'm having a hard time tracking your signal. How the hell should I know? I'm in some kind of cave. Right. The seawater pumping station. Lost the lights. That's all I need. Just look for the elevator. That should get you to the research facility. Sure. Okay, I want to get our binoculars out again, try and tag a few guys. I'm uh, telling you, we gotta get out of here. Strictly necessary. 
there is about wow six six to eight enemies in this area i always forget which um this is the harder section on this level uh, so as i said don't be afraid to backtrack for some ammo so i'm gonna let a shot off which is gonna alert enemies to my position if you have your flashlight on they see you much easier uh, so enemies are going to come to the right in between this gap here on the left as well so you just want to try and hide around this corner here I know it's really dark Ooh. This one can be a bit quite challenging. So there is still more to come. I think we've only killed about three or four. Binoculars are quite good at marking off enemies that you can't see, but also helps with hearing. Of course, they got that amplification thing to them. See if I can attract some more. I'm waiting for this last guy on the left side, but I'm pretty sure there's another guy as well. I'm trying to attract them over. Lights and sounds. Might see if this is a little bit risky, but okay, so he's seen me. Hopefully that means he's gonna come up to my position. Yep, yeah, he's running. There's a few guys here too. Okay, so that guy's running off to alert some other enemies. Okay, he's grabbed the guys that I believe are working on the power. So there was probably another three. Oh, actually, this should be the hopefully the last guy. Oh, 
Okay. I believe that should be everyone. Now we do have two lots of health and two lots of armor, so I can afford to be a little bit risky. Those three guys are normally from up here. And they're normally up here working on the power grid. And they're normally here. So there's health and ammo. But we're going to go up here and we're going to turn this power on. Go back down. There's actually two entryways to this area to take care of the three guys that are here if the you know that other fourth member didn't run off and alert them um, you can actually use this cave entry here which I actually find a little bit easier because they're normally standing up here so you can take care of them throw a grenade shoot them whatever um, up the stairs is not really a fantastic vantage point they can see you um, but yeah to get to that that cave so this is where we came through here it's basically on the left side of the generator and then in behind here this is where the uh, that cave entry is so yeah if those three other guys don't get alerted you can take care of them through here all right Believe it or not, that's actually the end of the level. It's pretty quick, I know. So we're going to carry this on. This is total chaos. I suspect by destroying the comp center, you caused mayhem throughout all the islands. The Trigens must have taken this opportunity to escape. Fascinating. Okay. So there's a glimpse of the Trigens. You can't, um can't really follow them this is just a dead end but um cool that's pretty much the end of the level I don't believe there is any health or anything in here let's do a quick check just to see yeah mm. it's a foot and that's the end of the level. Alrighty everyone, thanks for watching. Gonna keep moving on with Far Cry, the walkthrough. It's a good game. It's quite challenging in some of the levels. Next one coming up is quite fun though, I didn't mind it. Alrighty everyone, thanks for watching and catch you guys soon in the next one.